Hello everybody, my name is Chris Unlimited, and welcome back to my stream. Hey, so we're playing some classic Plants vs. Zombies today. And I am not liking this because my screen's about the size of a poacher stamp. Like, legitimately, what I'm looking at, I cannot see. Alright, I'm gonna see if I can see this little screen, and we're gonna play some... Wow, in my ears. Okay. Plants vs. Zombies! I'm in love with a zombie. Oh yes, the zombies. Oh, I've forgotten how much I love this game. Oh, 10 years, man, 10 years. Get your seed packet, yep, put her down. See right here. Alrighty, oh, click the suns, yes. It was very, um, what do you call it? Like, flash gamey, that's what you call it. Okay. Don't let the zombies reach your house. Don't want them to eat your brains. Yes, this is great. This is fantastic. This is nostalgia. This is what I wanted to play today. You betcha. I don't know. I had no idea what to play today. It took me actually... I, I started a little late anyway, and... Then I was like, I don't know what I would want to play. I thought about playing Warframe. I thought about playing... Uh, some more Mario Golf. I was like, eh. I'm sure I wanted to do that again. I mean, well, today. Let's say today. I mean, I know I definitely want to complete the courses and whatnot, because, hey, we're all in this together, right? Oh, I got the new plant. Oh no, there's so many zombies. Okay, game, I know what I'm doing. Yes, yes they are. Alright boys, let's get through this tutorial. Okay, yes, give me the sun and flowers. Now, you know, I've seen people play... I, I, I played the heck out of this game when it came out. I did. That was not a good spot to put you. Okay. Uh, I need more sun, please. Hurry. No, no, no. Give me... Thank you. Right there. Matter of fact, I'm... It's been a while since I played this, but and it's all coming back to me, boys. Matter of fact, we'll probably just blow right through this game because I play it so well. No. There's a strategy that most people don't stick with, and that is the fact that if you keep your last, your first two rows for nothing but sunflowers, you will normally just win the game. my tried and true method that I have beaten the game with multiple times so yeah it's been let's see this game came out 2009 I know I owned it by like 2010 it was just a cute little pop cap game that everybody had it was obviously you know like a flash game they had built and it was just one of the things As a matter of fact it was so popular it actually showed up in World of Warcraft they made a, a mini game of it, which, you know, by then World of Warcraft had already been old, but you know, it was kind of funny when they did it. If I ever get a chance to take somebody there, I'll show you guys. The Plants vs. Zombies phenomenon, unless they removed it from Warcraft. I don't think they did. It's like one of those projects they were probably all really hyped up on, buried it in the game, and then just forgot about it, so... Get him, my little pea shooters, yes. Oh, yes, the ch ch, -ch cherry bombs. Oh, I like cherry bombs. They're good. Yeah, a good one fit my whole name. Chris Unlimited? No, Chris Only Me. Only Me! I am the Only Me of this neighborhood. 
I don't know. I'm, you know what? What is it? Is it Tuesday? I don't even know what day this is. I'm just chilling out, guys. This game is very chill. <laughs> Until a certain point. And then it's like... We're coming. Yeah, I loved playing this game when it first came out. All my days blur together, really. I I usually never know what day it is. Oop. I meant to put that there. Somebody better give me some sun. Yes. Oh, man. Oop, oop, oop. Come on, I need some power. Now, the challenge is, do I need to get my cherries out? I might want to think about getting my cherries out. Oh, nope, they got his helmet off, okay. Or his cone, excuse me. Yeah, let's get some extra firepower, boys. Yeah, we're still kind of in training mode. We don't even have all of our... All five of our plots are... Yeah, you'd think the zombie would be like, Hey, I'm going to come over here in the dirt and just come right in. Nope. It's not the way it's set up. It's fine. Such a nice nice game just I remember okay when this came out first we were playing it a little bit on the internet we uh we got the we got the game disc actually bought the actual game put it on my computer just played the heck out of it it was great because I just fell in love with it I like strategy games I played it I beat it it's 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 really cool I like it I used to have this really let's see at the time when I was playing this I was working as uh it well i was the entire it department for a very small city so you know i'd come home whoop i didn't mean actually that's okay but i would come home and just kind of de-stress with this game and it was really fun to play but we got our ball nuts but yeah it's been a very long time come on give me give me give me yeah you right there Let's see. Now, normally what I'll do... I should have moved him over one, but... I like to give my... You know, I like to plan ahead. So, basically... I give two rows for my sunflowers, because I like a lot of sunflowers. Then I'll give at least two rows for pea shooters. And then I'll start putting in, like, the walnuts. But the high, higher levels, I do different things. Or at least, see, it's like I remember how to play. It's just I haven't done it in so long. I forget what what works and what doesn't. So, uh-oh, uh-oh. We got to get this guy some help. Get him. Don't let him eat your walnuts. Oh, I'm sorry. Ooh, I might need a cherry bomb for him. Uh, get him. Aw, oh, crap. I put that there, didn't I? See, I even mess up my own rows. Give me a cherry bomb. Come on, son, son, son. Get him. Okay. Sometimes I'll be watching somebody play this. And I'm like, no, no, you put that there. <laughs> or I'll watch them and they'll put like the pea shooters all along the first row. And then have their sunflowers out here getting eaten. And then I'm like, like, you're going to lose. You're going <laughs> to... You need to have them there. They need to generate sun. All right, we'll get them positioned. Fortified. Uh, it, give me, where's my shovel? I want to dig him up. Where's my shovel? No, I need my shovel. Now, when these get bigger, I like to, I like the man eaters right behind these so they can eat like the first one that comes along and tries to numb, tries to crunch and munch my walnuts. Uh, here you go. Okay. I should have moved these out. But there were zombies at the time. Now, see, guys, uh, a lot of people might not know this. Um, I actually, you know, because we got the game close to when it first came out. Um, originally, let's we'll get rid of all of them. There we go. Oh, the shovel. Yay. Quick, give me it. I got to take some plants up. So when this first came out, the dancing zombie that comes out was actually... Hey, Dave, how's it going? 
Crazy Dave. You can just call me crazy. Okay, crazy Dave. You got a surprise for me? Ooh. Need to clear my lawn? Oh man, he wants me to dig up plants? No. Okay. Have a surprise. Bowling! Oh yes, let's do some bowling. Cause you're crazy! Yeah, I got it. Uh, I speak to him over here like, Rock and roll! Yeah! They're putting the zombies down. I'm like, dude, chill. Strike! Oh, I almost got a couple. Uh, we're gonna let that one hit right there. Aha. Will you hit more than one? Come on. I could have blew him up, but you know, I like a little... Oh, look at that. We got a bouncy shot. Throw that in the middle. Strike. <laughs> let you have one, and you can have that one. <laughs> Send them in, boys. One for you. Curb Bluey, yes. Oh, we got a triple. I believe that's a turkey, huh? Rack him up again. <laughs> there we go. I love it when they come in bunched up like, oh, right there. Get all the ones with the hats. Get them cones out of my way. <laughs> Be gone. <laughs> Let's throw that right about there. Always remember with your bombs, don't throw them on the ends because they they do a radius. You know, they go like two, one up and one down. So it's basically like three. Share them. Oh yeah, these spud um, landmines. Yeah, the potatoes. Potato mine. It's spud again. Oh yeah. Anyway, okay, I was, I got interrupted. All right, so that they'll have a dancing zombie eventually and it comes out and he dances. Originally, it was like Michael Jackson. It had the red, it had the Michael Jackson hair from Thriller, his red, uh, you know, his red, uh, what do you call it? Red jacket that he had on. And it looked like Michael Jackson. He came out and he moonwalked and it was like, do, 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 do. They did that, you know, they did that beat like Thriller. And it was actually pretty cool. But, of course, around that time, he died. And so, it's like the game got released, Michael Jackson died, which, when did he die? Was that when he died? Or when he, uh... What was going on with Michael Jackson? Anyway, it was kind of a joke, a thriller joke. And I really enjoyed it, but then it was like, I believe that's when he died. God, I might be wrong, but... They, so they, they cut it. They completely removed the Michael Jackson zombie from the game. And they replaced it with uh, this like clownish looking disco stew kind of zombie looking guy. And I always thought that was a shame because it was a tribute. I mean, to like the 80s and like Thriller. And I was like, man, that was so cool. Because he moonwalked out. And I was like, do, 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 do. And then he had the zombies come up and help. I was like, it was so cool. I, I just thought that was a machine and, and every every game got an update they all updated and it got rid of the Michael Jackson zombie I was so I was like man you know I mean feel however you want about Michael Jackson but his music at the time in the 80s was you know definitely big you know brains. no brains no you can't have brains I don't even remember the last time I lost like a lawnmower was. 
Because honestly, if you keep your sunflowers here, you keep your shooters up here. Put a. Oh, I hate you. This guy will jump over like your first one, which he'll jump over a, a walnut, but not a tall nut. Um, he'll jump over like the landmines. But honestly, if you keep fire on him, whoa. -oh. Yeah. Yeah, see, they got him. I'm gonna take him out though. I am not doing that again. Set up some protection. Yeah, this is all you need for like the first few levels. Bee shooters, some sunflowers, and uh, yeah, just two right there. We don't get too hectic, you know? It's fine. I don't want to put that down. Because I like to watch them explode. Come on, pop him before he gets there. Nope, okay. Yeah, he's not armed yet. Yeah, what is the deal with making those... He ate it! <laughs> Having to arm the landmine before it gets moving. Technically, I should put them behind the walnut. I mean, honestly, that would be the way to go. Right. Trying to save up for my walnuts, but... Frozen pea shooter. Yeah, I like it because it slows down people. But my favorites is getting the flaming trees and sticking them right in front of the uh, P three Peter, letting it just take them out with fire. Yeah, two of these is really all you need in the beginnings. There we go, Frozy boy. All right, now this does change a little bit of strategy for those people that are counting on strategy. Yeah, yeah, we got this and this and this. Okay, so what I what I do next? Have your have your uh, sunflowers back here, you know. But I changed my order. So do you two two rows of sunflowers, and then the very next one, this is the frozen pea shooter. Then you do a regular pea shooter because that way your frozen boy. He's got a little extra protection. Um, guys, we need a shooter. If I remember to do it. Dude, dude, frozen dude. Okay. Yeah, so now we're going this deep for walnuts. Okay, good, 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 good. I like to, I normally I like filling them up real quick, but like in this case, I'm gonna wait to put him till I see where where they're dropping. Zombies! There we go. We get a pea, get a frozen shooter. <clears throat> Need a regular. Here we go. Make sure to get your sunflowers filled because it's the only way you're going to keep up with the demand that you're going to have. Make sure all of your rows have at least one shooter of some sort in them as you're building. And yeah, I like to be symmetrical, so keep your rows straight like any good gardener. You don't want your, you know, peas running up with your asparagus or your let you growing lettuce in the middle of your carrots. I that's just not how you do it. You keep them in rows, right? Um, I may need a cherry. I'm going to use a cherry. <laughs> all right, we have maxed out our sun flowers. I mean, you could technically keep going with sunflowers all the way to the end of the world, but come on. But yeah, I like the frozen ones back here because one, they're more expensive. Two, they slow down zombies. I should have put that somewhere else, but I didn't. Okay. <laughs> yeah, needed to back them up. Again, that not the best place to put that strategically, but I wanted to slow him down. Yeah, and the ice really does slow him down. It gets them to where they 
they slow down enough to where these guys are not a problem. Well, bring it on. The one row I don't have extra. Come on, come on. Give me sun, 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 sun. No, you don't. Aha. Get back in there. Yeah, I need one more frozen one there to slow him down. All right, we're popping now, boys. I don't even need to add the walnuts, but I'm gonna. Oh no, it's kind of overkill, but then again, it's like, nah, it's not overkill. I hate the fact that the suns actually disappear if you don't click on them. It's like, give me some time to mess with what I gotta mess with. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Coming and running with his javelin. Nah, 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 nah. That's not a javelin, is it? It's a pole vault. That's it. Die, zombie! Oh no, I thought we already had a huge wave. It's the final huge wave! No! Quick, give me some more protection. Yeah. Listen to him growl. That is hilarious. Um, do I want to put this down? Not really. Uh, yeah, honestly, I don't. Ah, there we go. There's my boy. There's my boy. That's the one I like. Hey, everybody. Chris Unlimited here. Uh, I'm just hanging out here at the end of the video. Just, you know, pointing out, reminding you that uh, I do have other videos on my channel. Uh, up here should be the newest one I did. And down here somewhere, there's going to be probably the most popular or most recommended or best for you, basically. And then somewhere in the middle should be a little subscribe box. Hit that if you enjoyed the content. I do stream every day or have been doing for the most part most days. Um, I stream all kinds of games, including the one you just watched. So check them out. Uh, say hi to me in chat. Come hang out. I've got a pretty good group of people that are, are all right people. They're really good. But uh, yeah, just a reminder, do what you got to do. But I hope to see you in future comments and in future live streams. See ya.